Hello guys, Monty here, and I'm going to be showing you my first tutorial today on this channel, and maybe on Streetline Production as well, so hello Streetline Production, so obviously if this is on Streetline Production, or so, here yeah, I'm going to be showing you a layer, trap code form layer mapping and displacement tutorial, I posted a video on it a couple of days ago, and what you're going to need to do this is trap code form obviously, and that's it, and a mask of a um, M40A3 or whatever gun you want to use. If you don't have a mask, I'll upload my mask folder. And I'll just show you my mask folder real quick. See all these masks in here. I'll upload this so you have an AK, AKU, AK, slow mo deagle change, like really slow mo, transition man, uh, marine and op 4, and M40A3. Uh, the, you won't have that. Okay, so what we're going to be doing today is showing you how to do this. So the particles flowing in, coming in, and then it forms the M48 free like that. And then you can just play out your clip or whatever. See it? The particles coming down. and then it forms the M40 alright so I can delete all this stuff bye bye yeah so just when I was checking make sure I could do everything correctly no mistakes alright so composition new comp M40A3 mask 12 8 by 720 whatever resolution you're using doesn't matter what the frame rate is, 60 because it's smooth. Then import file my M48 free mask, drag it in, effect, key in, key light, screen color, uh, turn the gain down just to get rid of the blue. Yeah, it looks good. Alright, that's done, that bit. Composition, new. Particle. Um, make the width 150 and the height 150, so it's a square. 60 frames per second, 7 seconds as well. Then add a new text layer. Um, then type the number one. I'm using base 05 font. I don't know, it's just random. I think it's the default one anyway. Um, then. Click the drop down menu down here and animate character offset, keyframe it, make it 8. Oh, what? Sorry. 0. Then go to the end. Then make it 8. So you see the numbers are just changing like this. Pretty clever. But yeah. Alright, then once you've done that, make it look a bit better. I'm going to add a is that a glow? Increase the radius a bit. Uh, I'll choose my own colours and pick dark blue and yellow. I don't know why. Um, then... Oh shit, no, don't, don't bother with any of this other stuff. Right, that's that bit done. That's the particle there. Now I'm gonna add a, make a new composition, which is the final. Final mask. Oh, it's spelling it there, it's all over the place. 1280 by 720, 7 seconds. Then drag in your previous thing, so like a particle. Uh, oh, the wrong one. This is the one I did just now. There we go, there's the particle and the M40A3 mask. Hide both the layers by clicking the eye, then layer, new solid 
make it black and call it form in effect trap code form if you don't have trap code form already why would you click on the video no I'm joking but um if you don't have it PM me and I'll tell you how to get it um because I don't want to say how to well you can go get a free trial but to get the full version PM me and I'll tell you where and how so I don't get in trouble right so change the particles in Z to 1 so now there's only one layer that you can see in the 3D preview box change the size of X and Y to your resolution that you're using 1280 by 720 then increase the particles in X and the particles in Y and then go to layer maps color and alpha layer M40A3 mask functionality lightness to A map over XY then displacement individual XY map over XY layer layer Z M40A3 you can see it a bit down there and to change that make it more visible go to particle change the size to like 5 then particle custom the particle type layer particle so now it's using the numbers current time loop random loop mm, wait here again here we go see the numbers there right, now change it to lighten that's that done in particle and strength put it to about 1500 50 go to the end oh bit, bit laggy there oh lag oh right go to 7 seconds god I'm lagging so much and then change the strength to 50 actually do it just before that because that's the end of the comp you want it to show up about there change it to 50 and then to get the little twisty thing at the start what? ignore that oh my god Right, one sec. If this is happening to you, then just change it to like a third or something. Bear lagging. Let's go back to the beginning. Right, and then twist and disperse. Keyframe, keyframe. 25. 8. Go to the end. Six seconds in, then change that to zero, and then change the twist to zero. And then there you go, that's it done basically. Pretty quick tutorial, took nine minutes. So um, if you did like it, give it a like and a comment or a positive video response of yours and be sure to subscribe and I'll be giving you more useful tutorials that not many people have seen before so yeah thanks okay bye